Thus spake Zarathustra, part seven. Oh my god. Having a clicking, clicky. Okay. <clears throat> Meanwhile, the evening came on, and the marketplace veiled itself in gloom. <clears throat> then the people dispersed, or even uh, curiosity and terror become fatigued, and Zarathustra, however, still sat beside the dead man on the ground, absorbed in thought. So he forgot the time, but at last it became night, and the cold wind blew the lonely one. Then arose Zarathustra and said to his heart, Verily a fine catch of fish hath Zarathustra made this day. It is not a man he hath caught, but a corpse. <laughs> Sombre is human life, and yet without meaning. A buffoon may... Uh, be faithful to it. I want to teach men the sense of their existence, which is the superman, the lightning out of the dark cloud man. But still, I am far from them, and my sense speaketh not to their senses. To men, I am still something between a fool and a corpse. Gloomy is the night, and gloomy there are the ways of Zarathustra. Come, thou cold and stiff companion, I carry thee to the place where I shall bury thee with thine own hands. He's lying. <laughs>